started to promote the internet Interpol more than 10 years ago. Uh, that time people were smiling on me and said, what that? what's that, internet Interpol? Okay, now it's, now it's coming truth. Cooperation between Kaspersky Lab and uh, new cyber division of Interpol. I uh, see it as a, well, only one and right way how to address this issue, how to investigate cybercrime in a cyberspace. And uh, I see they have to be, uh, there should be the cooperation from both sides. Uh, from other side, it's a technological experience. So our ability to read the code, to see, the, to take the data from the internet, uh, to trace the steps, traces of the bad guys. And uh, from Interpol, its ability to work internationally, to have a cyber, cyber to, to be connected with cyber divisions in uh, well, all the in 190 nations. Uh, so I think that uh, in this way. Uh, the uh, computer incidents will be investigated much, much faster. The cyber incidents, they are split into different categories. Uh, there is a cyber crime, cyber espionage, and cyber sabotage. Uh, cyber crime is just uh, financial motivated attacks or political motivated attacks to steal confidential data, to have access to their bank accounts, illegal access to bank accounts. Uh, Espionage, it's stealing uh, classified information or top secret information, their intellectual property. And cyber sabotage, it's attack on a critical infrastructure, uh, critical IT infrastructure, criti critical industrial infrastructure, and on the telecommunications. Uh, to me, the most critical and most dangerous, of course, it's a cyber sabotage, it's attack on the well, power plants, power grid, transportation, uh, telecommunications, financial sector, uh, healthcare. And I'm afraid this is the worst case scenario. And well, that's, that's, these scenarios, they really wake me up at night.